Hi friends, we're learning a number of skills as we grow in playing our low D whistles or whichever whistle you're playing. One of the new skills we need to develop is the ability to play a tune without looking at the tabs or without looking at music. Now, this is important for a number of reasons. First, a lot of traditional Irish music is not transferred person to person um, by handing out some music. Uh, it's going to be an oral tradition. You're going to watch someone play, you're going to listen to them, or you're going to learn the tune that's in your head and you need to be able to get that into your instrument. So the ability to hear a tune and then just start playing it is a very important skill. And that is something we develop though. It's not necessarily easy for everyone at the start. Please don't let that uh, be a cause for concern. Just keep pressing on. So it's a skill we need to develop. You'll also find as you try and learn some songs, like if you go to YouTube and somebody wants to teach you a traditional Irish tune, rarely are they gonna say, here's the sheet music to download, here are the tabs. They're gonna say, listen to me just racing through it. And then I'm gonna go line by line or phrase by phrase and you can repeat it. And then that's how you're taught music. So it's important for us to learn this skill of hearing or remembering and playing. So I wanted to give us an example today. And the example is um, the hymn, Be Thou My Vision. You see, I had gone through, I played through my stack of tunes that we shared. I did some um, scales. I did some um, other exercises. And then I thought, I wonder what hymns have Irish roots. And I looked it up and be thou my visions at the top of the list because it has very strong Irish roots. The words are based on a sixth century um, Irish uh, poem and the tune is from an Irish folk tune named Slain. And the name Slain actually comes from a very significant hill in St. Patrick's story. So strong Irish roots. Now I know the hymn, so I thought, all right, I'm not gonna look at the music. What note would I start on that would enable me to go all the way down and all the way up and uh, be in a key that I can play? <laughs> those, are, those are all concerns. So what I wanna do for us today, I'm gonna play through it, and then we're gonna walk through some of the phrases. We need examples of how this happens. What I want you to do is if you know the hymn, I would like you to just try and play it. I found that if I start with the G, that's on my low D whistle, the G is the top three holes covered. If I start there, I can play the tune without running out of notes top or bottom. If you know the hymn well, pause the video, go and see if you can play it, and then come back and pick up here. So. Let's we'll run through it once, and then I'll take you uh, through the phrases. So I'm going to play through it, and I'll stand so that you can see my hands better. So, um, <clears throat> I'm going to go through the, the first phrase of that, which actually starts off with the top three holes covered. And I'll try and accentuate my fingering. And then 
from there. So what you'll do if that second section helped you out, then um, watch one of the phrases, pause the video, try the phrase a couple of times. Restart the video, pause at the end of the phrase, try that phrase a couple of times. And then after you've gone all the way through the song, see if you can go beginning to the end of Be Thou My Vision. This is how we're going to learn some of the tunes. It's a new skill in some ways for me. I did start learning to do this uh, many years ago, but I did not start learning to do this until I had been playing a woodwind instrument for, wow, over 10 years. Um, I found it important and valuable, and I would like you to try it as well. Let me know how that's going for you, and uh, don't get exasperated. Try it out. We'll keep trying this with some other tunes. It's a good skill. If you do read music, grab the music if you can find it, because I guarantee you can't always find it. Until next time, this is Scott Shade. Happy. Low D whistling.